What's up, y'all? I got a family defeat, so let's get into this tea. Now, this is part two of the Tamar situation. And uh, y'all was telling me, well, Kia was telling me in the comments that, um, well, all y'all was telling me in the comments that Tamar was actually asking Krishan to be on live. And y'all know I have the live, but um, thanks to Kia, we got a shorter version. So shout out to who this, y'all know I got to get that shout out for we have an issue. Nosy by standards. Hello. Shout out to her. She breaks this down a little bit. Let's get into it. Now, this is a follow-up. Okay. Because Krishan has something to say. Okay. She says, I don't get disrespectful till you get disrespectful. Hello. And she doesn't elaborate on what that means. Uh, but shout out to Live Bites, and I'm going to tag them below, because they just uploaded this um, live stream between Krishan backstage with Tamar. Did you get on stage now? Uh, Tamar, you know. About this. Got to yeah, block that Thank out. you for blocking that out. <laughs> but listen. Block out the other side. Uh, okay. As Krishan was minding her business, drinking whatever she was not supposed to be drinking, by the way. I get it. She grown. You can't tell a grown person. Yes, you can. If you don't want that grown person tearing up your equipment, if you don't want that grown person tearing up your goddamn uh, concert. I mean, damn, all of us know everything about Krishan when it comes to her being aggressive. How the hell Tamar don't know? I don't, I don't understand. <sighs> Make sure it's a vibe all the motherfuckers. Oh, we gotta go. Now, if you didn't catch that exchange between Tamar Braxton and Krishan, let me lay it out for you. Now, Tamar asked Krishan. <laughs> I love this. I gotta do this. <laughs> getting on stage. Krishan answers and says, yes, her manager is on it. Tamar replies back, your manager, <laughs> question mark. And Krishan then proceeds to say, yeah, he's on that little ish. Like he's getting on making sure that she performs on stage. Now, a lot of people in the comments all across social media who have attended Tamar shows says tons of people come on stage and sing. So when Krishan had got on stage and did that song, I believe, I cannot remember the name of the song, um, I'm assuming that's what Tamar meant when she said, are you going to be on stage? But Krishan thought that she was going to get her own private performance, which she did not get. And that is how the altercation ensued. So it seems mm. to be a lack of communication. Because yes. in Tamar's defense, why would you need a manager if you're just coming on, on stage just to sing and kiki with us? Uh -huh. And in Krishan's perspective, she's like, I'm supposed to have my own performance. So my manager needs to make sure that it's set up accordingly. And so she gets paid accordingly. But that's not the type of show or concert that Tamar typically hosts. Now, if more details in accordance to what happened last night comes out, I'll keep you guys posted. I mean, because what, what you need her there for, knowing, okay, okay, y'all, this, this is so all over the place. Why would you need Krishan there? And this ain't no damn, this ain't no booty shaking uh, concert. You know what I'm saying? Like, during her, in between her sets with, with Tamar, I mean, it should be old songs like with Avant and shit. Um, you know, Eric Benet, you know what I'm saying? Deborah Cox, you know what I'm saying? Like, that's the type of music that need to be played in between. Come on, give me that green light. Uh, why would we go from love and war to it's a vibe all the time? Huh? <laughs> Can you imagine cutting off love and war and then going, it's a vibe? No. Everybody probably would have been in there like, <laughs> <clears throat> I didn't come in here for that energy. Y'all know damn well if we had an R&B concert, we want R&B. Y'all know damn well if we had a hip-hop concert, why in the hell are you playing Step in the Name of Love? Why? For why? Okay? <sighs> Over it. Y'all, I want to read what Blueface Mama said. Dumb Mama, all right? She done jumped in. She called Tamar, uh, what, this, this little debacle with Tamar, she called it bullshit. And right here, I'm with you, Carlissa. Girl, I'm with you when you're right, because you're right. All right? 
She beat up her man mama. Facts. Girl, she whooped his mama. And you thought she wasn't going to come to your prominent? And I use the word prominent because that was one of those shows. When you got Tony Braxton in the building, you use the word prominent. You get what I'm saying? Tony Braxton. Prashawn Rock. What? Anyway. Okay. You knew that baby needed help when you brought her there. Facts. Your security should be responsible for bringing her there, knowing she's worse than when she started. Facts. No, ma'am. She getting a Power Ranger pass. Hello? If you want to have her to help her, your follower, to help your following, you need the proper security or wait until she's healed. Respectfully, the mama. Okay? Baby, I'm with you when you're right. Let me ask y'all, um, 21 and down people. Have y'all ever heard a song from Tony Braxton? I, I, I'll wait. Do, <laughs> yeah, I got, there's my next question. Do you even know who Tony Braxton is? I'm. Okay. Now, a lot of y'all saying yes. Bet. If you go into a Tony Braxton concert, <clears throat> would you expect Krishan Rock to come out of the, out of the blue, shaking her ass to survive all the time? Would y'all expect that from Tony Braxton? I want to know. F no, no, no. Uh-uh. I didn't think so. I'm expecting Dr. Dre to be at the uh the phone booth. You know what I'm saying? Lying. Telling her he ain't coming home tonight. Because he 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 trying to figure something out. And she telling him to just be a man about it. You get what I'm saying? Now I'm not saying Tony Braxton ain't ratchet. That ain't what I said. <laughs> But she ain't ratchet at her show. See, y'all ain't putting two and two together. You can be ratchet all the hell you want. Hell, I'm ratchet. But I bet you if you caught me at a Tony Braxton show, I would be on my classy shit, pinky up, drinking Merlot. Hello? Y'all don't see Tony Braxton out here showing her ass? Girl, we all ratchet. Hell. I'm, I am... <laughs> behooved okay at this befoolery in my face okay i'm just not understanding the whole situation and it's just it's, it's, i don't like it okay tamar should be uh sued period <laughs> You should be sued. You the one who invited her. You the one who begged her. You the one who damn near dragged her out her house when she was in her own element smoking her reefer and minding her business sober. And you got her out in a different, a different element. Fuck Tamar. Okay. I am over Tamar. They should sue the, they should sue the security. If they sue Krishan, Krishan better sue the security company. Period. If they sue Krishan, I will sue Tamar. Point blank. Period. I'm suing Tamar. I'm suing the security company. Because why in the hell are you begging me to come somewhere that I don't even need to be? I'm not even getting a check for. Girl, bye. Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. We are done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.